Mother Goose is here now, here now, here now. Mother Goose is here now and Lucy too. We're gonna have fun, yes, we're gonna have fun, yes, we're gonna have fun. There's lots to do. Mother Goose is here now, here now, here now. Mother Goose is here now and Lucy too. Can you say, hi, Lucy? Oh, Lucy, look, our friends are back to have some more fun with us today. And, oh, oh, Lucy, do you have something stuck in your mouth? Oh, well, let me take that for you. Go ahead, spit it out. Oh, look at that. Lucy brought a letter for us today. Do you know what letter this is? It's the letter H. Say H. Hmm, H, H. What begins with H? House and hide begin with H. Let's play a little game. I am going to hide the letter H inside one of my houses. I have three houses, blue, red, green. I'm going to hide the letter H inside one of these houses. And then you have to guess, where did Mother Goose hide the letter H? All right, no peeking now. Close your eyes. Don't peek. Close your eyes. I'll tell you when you can open them again. Okay, keep them closed. No peeking. Are your eyes closed? <laughs> yes? All right, let's see. Which house do you think I hid the letter H in? <laughs> you can open your eyes now. All right, your eyes are open and you're looking at the houses. We have a blue house, a red house, and a green house. Which house did I hide that letter H in? What do you think? Is it the blue one? Or the red one? Or the green one? Hmm. What's your guess? All right, we'll take a peek inside the red house. Let's take off that roof and see what's inside the red house. Ooh, inside the red house is the letter H. You found it. Great job. And inside the red house, there's also a hat. Hat. Hat begins with the letter H. Should we take a look and see if there's anything in the other houses? Thumbs up if you want to take a look. You do? Me too. Which one should we look in first? The blue one or the green one? Blue house, green house. Hmm. All right, we'll look in the green house first. Let's take off the roof and see what's inside the green house. Oh, looks like we have another letter. What is it? H, that's right. We have a blue H and a yellow H. And what is this animal inside? Do you know what animal that is? Hippopotamus. Hippopotamus begins with H. H, H, hat begins with H. H, H, hippo begins with H and house begins with H. Well, that's just wonderful. What? Oh, you want to see what's inside the blue house too? <laughs> okay, I'll open up the blue house. Let's see what's inside. Take off the roof and let's see. Ooh, did you get a peek? <laughs> what is that yummy treat? Inside the blue house, there's a hamburger. <sighs> hamburger begins with the letter H. Ha, ha, hippo begins with H. Ha, ha, hat 
begins with H. And ha, ha, hamburger begins with H. Great job! We found a lot of things that begin with H. And I have one more to show you. Hiding behind these numbers is something else that begins with the letter H. Let's practice counting our numbers first, and then we'll take them off one by one and see what's hiding behind our numbers. Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Let's take off the number one first and see what's hiding behind it. It's something that begins with the letter H. One. Hmm. Can you guess what it is yet? Let's take off the number two. Say two. What do you think it is? I can see some colors. Red and yellow. Let's take off the number three. Three. Are you getting a better idea now? Let's take off the number four. Four. We'll keep going. Five. Do you know what it is yet? Six. Just a few more left. Seven. Eight. And the last one. Nine. What did we find hiding behind all of those numbers? Yes. Ah, hot dog. Hot dog begins with H. Great job, everyone. Let's try making the letter H. Do you have a salt tray that your grown-up gave you to use? If you don't, that's okay. You can just follow along with me with your finger. But if your grown-up says it's okay, you can get some type of little salt tray. All you need is the lid of a cookie tin or the lid of a box or a cookie sheet. And then ask your grown-up to put some salt in for you. When we're all done today, you could put the whole thing inside a great big bag like this one, and you'll have it for the next time we practice writing our letters. If you need to pause the video to go ask your grown-up if you can have one, go ahead and hit pause. I'll be right here waiting for you when you get back. All right, are you ready now? And if you don't have a salt tray, you can use your finger and share mine, all right? So first, we're going to hold our finger up. So fingers up. You're going to take your finger and put it at the tippy tippy top of your salt tray. And then we're going to make a long line all the way down to the bottom. Ready? Go. Down, 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 down. Fingers up. Can you see I have one long line? Now we're going to put our finger back at the top, but over here a little bit. Here's our first one. Now we're over here. We're going to draw another line all the way down. Ready? Go. Down, 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 down. Fingers up. Now I have two long lines. Fingers back up. We're going to go about in the middle of those two lines, and we're going to make a short line straight from one to the other. Ready? And that's it. You made the letter H. You can give it a tiny little shake to erase it, or you can smooth it out with your hand. And we'll try it one more time. Ready? Fingers up. Finger at the tippy top. And go down, 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 down. Finger back up. Move it over a little, but still at the top. And go down, 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 down. Finger up. Now put it in the middle of that first line, and we're going to go this way until we touch the other line. Ready? Zip! And you did it! A great big letter H! Hooray! <laughs> Hooray begins with H. So many fun things begin with H.
the letter H. Great job sharing that with us today, Lucy. And now it's time for us to say goodbye. It's time to say goodbye now, goodbye now, goodbye now. It's time to say goodbye now to Mother Goose. We had a great time. Yes, we had a great time. Yes, we had a great time. We hope that you did too. Bye, everyone.